guys welcome to another video you got mr everything english and in this video guys we're gonna go over a topic that we've been waiting for for a long time now since probably june last year i've been getting asked what are the changes what are the changes what are the changes and to be honest with you guys we were all guessing we were all guessing there were educated guesses but we were all guessing now the government guys recently announced what the changes are to english um and guys the changes are not much the changes are not much so what has been changed when it comes to english guys english language remains exactly the same there are no changes at all for english literature this is what they've changed so for paper one for english literature you you choose two out of these three topics now when i say you i mean your school now what are the three topics it's either the poetry anthology which is your power and conflict and your love and relationship it's either the 19th century novel which are texts like jekyll and hyde christmas carol frankenstein and so on and then you have your modern text which is your inspector calls and so on your school either already have or should be over the next few weeks deciding which one of these three they will drop and which two they will keep then on the day of your GCSE exam paper 1 will have these three topics inside that exam you as a student will answer the two that your school did not drop now for these three questions you are marked out of 30 for AO1 AO2 AO3 notice guys that paper 1 has no spag you are not marked for AO4 for paper 1 and that is the changes to paper 1 Now paper 2 we have no option everyone up and down the country must do these three it is not a choice where we here have a choice of two here everyone answers these three now what are the three everyone must do shakespeare everyone so whether you're doing macbeth or whether you're doing your romeo your school has to teach you this and you must prepare for shakespeare in your exam then everyone must do the unseen poetry questions so the first unseen poetry question is they give you one unseen poem and they make you answer a question about that unseen poem and then the second unseen poem which is a eight mark question will give you another unseen poem so now you have two unseen poems and it may ask you look at the similarities or the differences between the two unseen poems this exam marks you for spag So this exam marks you for AO1, AO2, some AO3 for Shakespeare and AO4 which is your spag. And guys, that is it. That is the changes they have made to the English GCSE for AQA. Your exam dates are for May and June. Your results day guys, I believe is on August the 25th. So all that stuff, guys, it remains how it was pre-COVID. We've basically gone back to how life was before COVID. The only thing that's changed is they've removed one topic and that's it guys. Now we knuckle down, now we know exactly what to focus on. And that's it guys. Those are the changes that should direct your revision and that should direct your preparation. All right guys, I hope you found the video beneficial. It's been Mr. Everything English. Peace.